What's going on YouTube? It's your guy Kent Hollywood Matzinger and we are back at it. Today's video we are going to talk all about Hasbro Pulse Fan Fest 2021. We are about a week away from this event launching. So uh, what do you need to know to check out everything going on with uh, this live event coming from the people at Hasbro Pulse? Uh, definitely stay tuned. We're going to talk about it all during this video. Uh, early access, shows, different panels, all kinds of great stuff coming up very soon. So uh, come on back and uh, let's talk about Hasbro Pulse Fan Fest 2021. Next, Camp Pool Live. Welcome back. So what is Hasbro Pulse Fan Fest? Uh, it's an opportunity for the people at uh, Hasbro to uh, show us some of the different items that are going to be coming out here in 2021. Uh, some figure reviews. Uh, sounds like there's going to be giveaways, special guests, and uh, content kind of behind the scenes of uh, what it takes to bring those figures to uh to retail <laughs> i know uh it's been a crazy year kind of um lift figures getting to retail and across the board so i'm sure there's going to be a lot of excited people to see what uh hasbro has planned next and uh this fan fest is a great way for them to uh kind of let the public know what the plans are going forward with uh, Hasbro Pulse and some of its great product lines. Uh, there will be different panels. You're going to have your Power Rangers, uh, Fortnite panel, Transformers, Marvel Legends, Star Wars. So a great opportunity to check in on some of these Hasbro teams. And I'm sure they'll have some great information about uh, what they've been working on. But uh, come on back and uh, we'll talk about membership to Hasbro Pulse. And uh, maybe some of the benefits that uh, being a member will provide. Are you a Hasbro Pulse premium member? Uh, membership fee typically runs $50 for the year. Uh, some of the benefits are shipping. Uh, when you're making your orders on Hasbro Pulse, you get uh, free standard shipping on your items. Uh, as it comes to FanFest, premium members are going to have an opportunity to kind of see a little kickoff, a little pre-party Thursday night. Uh, I believe that's going to start at 5 p.m. Eastern. If you are a Hasbro Pulse Premium member, you probably got an email uh, asking if you wanted to join this event. Could be interesting to see what uh, what they're going to preview before the Fan Fest starts the following day uh, at 11 a.m. <laughs> Friday morning. But uh, yeah, so a little Thursday night pre-show, uh, you get that free shipping on your items. And as it comes to Fan Fest, it looks like you're going to get an opportunity to order a lot of the products that might be revealed on Friday uh, prior to 5 p.m. when uh, things will launch to everybody it looks like on the Hasbro Pulse uh, website. So there are definitely some perks to being a Hasbro Pulse member, premium member. Let me know in the comments, are you a Hasbro Pulse premium member? And does any of this uh, fan fest stuff making you think about joining? Let me know in the comments. Hasbro Pulse fan fest starts at 11 a.m. Friday morning, April 9th, and uh, here is kind of the card. There's not really time scheduled, 
but uh, it's kind of from 11 a.m. until 5 p.m. So might be some filler, might be some in-between stuff. But uh, 11 a.m. they kick off with a live stream opener. So I'm sure they'll kind of talk about what's going on during the day. Maybe some interaction between some of our different Hasbro teams. Maybe uh, some of our guests that uh, they've talked about uh, being part of the Fan Fest. So that'll kind of kick things off. The first panel on the Hasbro Pulse website is showing uh, Fortnite. So I did pre-order the Snake Eyes Fortnite figure. We'll see what additional Fortnite figures they uh, reveal and possibly release on that Friday. Uh, next panel up is Transformers. Uh, I'll let all my Transformer people uh, tell us in the comments what uh, you're looking forward to the most. Uh, I enjoy seeing Transformers in store. Don't know how much I'll uh, follow this panel, but uh, I'm sure there'll be some cool things uh, with the Transformers panel. Next up, another thing I enjoy <laughs> seeing in store, helping people pick up uh, Power Rangers panel. So it'll be interesting to see what new releases. Uh, I feel like a lot of stuff came out for Power Rangers last year. So we'll see whether or not Hasbro is going to slow down any when it uh, comes to those Power Rangers and reveals releases. After Power Rangers, the panels <laughs> that I definitely uh, am pumped and can't wait to see uh, G.I. Joe brand panel. Uh, I would not expect a ton of focus just on classified will probably see some three and three quarter inch in fact i feel like the last panel we had uh the three and three quarter inch kind of was more so than the classified series uh definitely excited i think i'll probably do a classified uh video so definitely stay tuned for that uh this coming week but uh let me know in the comments Again, uh, let's try not to dump all the leaks and stuff in the comments because definitely want this to be fun for people. But if you have something that you'd love to be announced, uh, let me know in the comments. Definitely excited to hear what G.I. Joe's you would like to see down the line. Next up, Marvel Legends. I know there has been a leak. I'll probably do a couple videos during the week. Uh, seems like uh, our poor, poor Marvel Legends group uh, always get leaked prior to uh, before these events. So uh, definitely excited what I've seen, if it's true. But uh, I'll come at you with some more Marvel Legends videos. Excited, of course, to see what's next for Marvel Legends and what little... Uh, extras they might put out there because you know they can't finish a panel without uh leaving us guessing what might be next so pretty cool uh finished panel will be star wars so the star wars kind of lining up there to the end which uh will play into something that uh i think is kind of funny with the premium membership so yeah, last group will be our Star Wars, probably vintage, uh, black series. So probably some great stuff in that panel. But uh, the Star Wars is the only uh, group product from Hasbro that's being advertised as not releasing early. Again, I think some of that has to do with it being the last panel and everything kind of being open to the public at uh, 5 p.m. So Star Wars will definitely be running into that 5 p.m. time as reveals are coming out. So I don't know if they can post them early for the members, if that's uh, the reason why we're not getting the extra little time as premium members, like with the other groups of figures it sounds like there'll be an opportunity to order those before 5 p.m when everything 
So that is our lineup. Let me know what you think of Hasbro Pulse Fan Fest. Are you looking forward to it? Are you going to sign up for that premium membership this week to uh, get ready for everything that uh, possibly will be dropped early on Friday? Or will you just hang out and uh, wait to see what other retailers are getting these uh, different figures being released? Uh, Amazon uh, going to retail with Target and Walmart. Good old Walgreens. Uh, definitely lots of opportunities to buy outside of Hasbro Pulse. But uh, let me know what you think in the comments. Are you going to be watching all day? Are you going to just be catching different pieces of panels? And uh, if this is your first time finding the channel, uh, we got a lot of great things going on here on YouTube, also over on Instagram at Kent Pool Live. So uh, turn on those notifications, hit that like button, comment, and share. All those things uh, definitely help out the channel. But uh, I hope everybody has an awesome Hasbro Pulse Fan Fest and uh, look forward to talking to everybody more about the events, about the news as it comes out next week. Until next time, always be hunting, have fun collecting.